Well, hi everybody, Ellen here from Target Training, and I've got our registered dietitian, Jess, and she is going to help us so much today because I have so many dancers who come to me or I will see them on a competition day and they can't eat on competition days because they're nervous, um, they're anxious about everything that's happening, and the thought of eating just is disgusting. And so we need help because we need that fuel and so Jess is here to help us with that. So the number one thing you cannot do on competition day is not eat. So I have also talked to a lot of dancers who express this, but they don't want to eat and then puke because that doesn't help you either. Um, so we're going to talk about smoothies today. This is something that a lot of people talk to me about and that I talk with them, um, but they're not all created equal. So a lot of folks on competition days are in a hotel, they don't have access to a blender, so you can go to a store and, and get some of these things, but there's some really big tips we're gonna talk about of how to make these smoothies the most bang for your buck. And also easy on your stomach, so you can just sip on them while you're kind of getting ready to dance, whether it's hair, makeup, getting your clothing all ready. Um, but we're gonna give you some tips on how to keep it easy on your stomach, but give you enough fuel so that you can really perform well. Mm. Let's do it. Yeah. Making a smoothie is really simple and actually really kind of fun. I always recommend you start with a yogurt base. If you can choose a plain yogurt, it's gonna be a little bit healthier for you, a little less sugar than what you need. And then adding fruits and veggies is fantastic. If you add some banana, it's gonna have some extra potassium. Your blueberries are gonna have lots of antioxidants. Smoothies are also a great way to get in more vegetables. So trust me, those bananas and blueberries, you'll never ever taste the spinach. And then really just keep blending till it's a texture that you enjoy. There you go. Enjoy!